We play. We fight. We conquer. Welcome back to the Freak Show, where our one rule is beware of traps. I am your host, Bubby McSquiggums. We're playing the Bard's Tale Trilogy. We're being attacked by a nomad, and yeah, I suppose that's fine. It feels much louder. I think I might have adjusted some of the sound effects here. Ah, eh, that's okay. All right, we're gonna go and I guess cast spells. Uh, sure, I guess. Uh, what's our song gonna be? Oh, our song is almost done. Let's get Marcus to go first. Traveler's tune. We're gonna go with Merlin. Spell list. Uh, levitation. Bellist, magic compass, bellist, seal spell thingy, and sorry, the uh, stone. Okay, and then the shield. That's all. All right, we go here. We're gonna restore everything. Yep. Okay. Oops. Uh, actually. All right. We will defend our island, whatever the cost may be. All right, we are going to actually fix this. Sorry, guys and gals. I think, yeah, I set this up a bit high. All right. And everybody's good. I want to see if there's anything to identify. There is an unidentified offhand. It's a mithril shield. Okay, that's actually good, I think. Uh, let's see. What did I hit? Okay, I was scroll off. Oh, what is that? Okay. So the tower shield is a plus two. And the mithril shield is a plus three. So, what does Marcus currently have? A tower shield. I think we give it to Marcus, maybe. Well, uh, what is you well, yeah, what do you have? You had the mithril shield. Alright. So yes, it makes sense to give it to Marcus. Though I see, I say that, and yet I feel like El Cid is the one getting absolutely wrecked constantly. But it's okay. Mithril shield will work. Yeah, yeah, that's that seems fine. Okay, let's get back into the place. We're on floor three. Not, I mean, not right now, but that's how deep we've gotten, and we're going to try to continue our adventures on floor three. Oops. And it should be fine. Uh, yes. Okay. Has anybody hurt a little bit? No? Nope. Seems like everybody's fine. Uh, Marcus, uh, why don't you order a mead for yourself? Okay. And we will also wind it up. Unfortunately, we still have to go through at least one or two places that are darkness to get to various places that we want to go. Ah, it's just not worth the effort. If it was something easy to battle that we could just, like, immediately kill, I'd be fine with it, but it's, it's not. Alright, let's take a look at the thing. So we have to go through the darkness over here in order to get to the next floor. Which will put us on floor two. And then we do that by going this way. And this is Black Widows. Five Black Widows always. Ah, uh, that's fine. We'll take that fight. We do still want to get into some fights. Okay, uh, that worked. Um, a little worried about the wolves, but we'll see. I think I'm going to actually turn this up a little bit more. There we go. And this should be the destruction of the wolfy wolves. There we go. I might even turn it up a little bit more than that. We'll see. Uh, nah. I wouldn't normally mind that fight, but 
With the conjurer being slightly further away, I don't, I don't want to run the risk. All right, where are we at now? Wait. Did, didn't we finish the sewers level two? It doesn't look like it. But did we go down to sewers level three? I'm, I'm confused now. No, I guess we didn't. Right? We... We didn't go to the sewers level three. We were, okay, so I think I think I'm the cellars, and then we're in sewers level one. This is sewers level two. And yeah, we haven't gone further than this. All right, I think we can get our light back. I don't know that we need to go through any more darkness, necessarily. So, let's... Uh, we'll let Omar do it. So again, things should be a little nastier than what we've seen before. Oh, there's another uh, portal. Uh, I don't know about the portals. Oh, oh, did we hit another one of those things? We don't know where we're at now. All right, so what I kind of want to do from here when we were able to okay oh yeah it did fix it I say when we were able to um... when we ran into the because there's a teleporter like that that's blocking our way in the town but when whenever we left after we got like teleported by it after a few steps in familiar territory we were able to like regain our our composure and understand where we were. And I was wondering if we could do that now or if it would not allow us to do that. And it looks like, yes, it does. Because I didn't have to end up casting an additional spell, which is great. All right. So let's be clear. Where are we? Oh, we're over here. Okay, now we're over here. Okay, we see that thing now. A door, nine spiders. That could be kind of problematic, I suppose. I think we'll be all right. We got a kill from Marcus. Got a kill from El Cid. El Cid, of course, gets bit. Got a kill from Brian. And now we have the invisibility spell, so we should be pretty much untouchable. And just a slow, methodical process of killing them all off. All right, uh, we got some unidentified armor, uh, which I would like to see if we can identify. I absolutely should have stole before we left. Plate armor, okay. Yeah, we're pretty full up on items. I guess I forgot that. Hey, and a spear. Wow, twice. Demand. All right. That's that's fine. Okay, three sorcerers. We theoretically should have this. One, two, a hit, and spell three. Okay. Or El Cid, that's three. All right. Very nice. Three nomads. This won't be a... Problem for us. Didn't quite have the uh, the rolls there on damage to obliterate them straight up. Uh, where are we at on overall? Oh, we got a ways to go. Okay, that's fine. Mad dogs and a magician, huh? All right, attack, attack, attack. And hide, and then defend, defend. Mm, I was hoping that the guy would move up and we could hit him for the, you know, for, with range and all that, but yeah, this is fine. Oh, we could here. Alright, I'm actually going to cast just the little baby... Oh, wait. Basic fire won't reach. 
Okay, Sir Grady uh, battled that. And Dunzo. What did we just get? There was something that we got there. I don't know what it was, though. Apologies. Yeah, it doesn't look like anything that standing out, so yes, we'll take it. Ten spiders, alright. Um sure. Poke them. And they're all gone. Mithril Dagger? Is that what we just got? I got it. Yeah, we got a Mithril Dagger. I gotta stop skipping through stuff quite so quickly. Why Why does this have like a... Like a book note thing, but I can't... Okay. I don't know. There are tracks here leading east. I mean, yes, there are oh, a bunch of jade monks. Sure. A ninety-five percent chance to hide, and we failed. Uh, and then we got punched a couple times. Well, Sid's a little bit banged up here. We'll take it. Uh, we don't often face the zombies because they can be kind of nasty, but we'll give it a shot. Okay, not quite enough. Ouch. Right, we killed one. We got the buff up, so we're going to get another kill here with Sir Grady. There it is. We got a kill with El Cid and Marcus and Brian. There it is. Decent. Never ends, huh? Oops. Uh, let's do this. And nope, that doesn't end either. My goodness. Oh. Uh, the conjurers are the first things. Everything else doesn't seem that difficult. So yeah, I'm here for it. There's four conjurers, though. We're only going to be able to kill at least, uh, at most two. Or sorry, at most three. Probably only two. All right. Um, yeah, I'll do one to the conjurers, and we're going to go over to the others, and then I'm going to guarantee the conjurer kill with Sir Grady. Defend, defend. Sir Grady got a kill. Uh, El Cid got a kill on a mercenary. Marcus hit a mercenary, and Brian killed the other conjurer. And now, I guarantee the kill there, and then everybody else is going to attack the dogs. And I like it. Pretty quick, pretty easy. And we said good day, dogs, maybe. Probably one that's going to live. Nope, two. All right, well... They won't walk away from this one. We got a staff. You know what we can do, actually, to increase uh, our inventory size? I think, I think we can do this. Maybe I'm wrong. Yeah, we can go through each person and have them equip a light source. Because I think we have enough torches and lamps and things, don't we? Yeah. I think that's it, though. Alright. 
Well, that gave us a little bit more inventory space. All right, where are we at now? Yeah, we're over here. Straight ahead? Yeah. Alright, what is here? Oh. Ah, uh, yeah. No, this seems fine. Hide in the shadows. Defend, defend. Let's do it. I'm going to have to throw a heal on El Cid at some point. He's down like 30 HP. I'll wait until he's down into the, into the 60s, and then we'll uh, throw a big heal on him. All right, I'm going to go with an attack on the Barbarians. Attack on the Barbarians. An attack on the Half-Orc, and then an attack on the actual Orcs? Maybe? Oh. Dead Orc. Hurt Half-Orc. Dead Barbarian. Dead Barbarian. And that's fine. All right. Uh, attack on the orc. Attack on the barbarian. Attack on the half orc. Attack on the barbarian. Okay. So Grady got three. Sid got one kill. Barbarian smacked Marcus. Half orc got hit again. Brian killed somebody. And now we have the invisibility, which is nice. Attack on orc, attack on orc, attack on barbarian, attack on half orc. Defend. Half orc's still alive. It's crazy. Orc dead. Other orc dead. Attack on barbarian, attack on orc, attack on half orc, attack on barbarian. Defend, defend. Let's go. And now we have one of each. I believe. Can't believe the half orc is still alive. All right, we finally did it. We killed the half orc, and we killed everything. All right, two thousand uh, cash monies, nearly four hundred experience. Okay, we'll take it. That is not too shabby. Wait. Okay, that's fine. Didn't I see a portal at some point? I feel like I did. All right, let's go see what's over here. Oh, Black Widows. I'm gonna run. Oh, hey, it's, it's the, the thing that we've been looking for. It's the magic mouth. A magic mouth on the wall speaks. Know this, that a man called Tarjan Gar Carj Tar I is it a T a C a G I think it's a T uh, anyway a man called Tarjan maybe or Carj well, anyway uh, thought to many to be insane had through wizardly powers proclaimed himself a god oh oh the insane the mad god this is the guy Tar Tar Tarzan Tarjane Jan Whatever. Um, in Scarabray a hundred years ago. His image is locked in stone until made whole again. Tarjan. Tar, tar, car, whatever. We'll try a few different names. I don't think there's a penalty for that. Cool, we found the magic mouth. Sweet. Where did I see a portal? I swear I saw one. Well, I don't know where the heck it was. Like, I, I skipped past it, like, at, at one point, I'm like, oh, there was a portal over there. I mean, I, I don't think I want to go down the portals at this point. We were looking for the magic mouth, right? And that, Well, that answers the, the thing for the mad god. Tar, tar, Tarjan. Tarjan. Tarjan? Garjan. I don't, I don't know. All right, hiding in the shadows. Monk dead, monk dead. And then just murder the mercs. There's one, two, and three. Take it.
Uh, eight barbarians and two skeletons. All right. We got a lot of magic that we can use. Uh, attack, 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 attack. I think I'm going to cast his flesh thing. Flesh restore on El Cid. Eh. I mean, it doesn't mean it's going to fully heal him. Alright, we got a crit. We got a kill. We got a hit. Yeah, it was pretty close. And we got another kill. Barbarian, 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 Um, skeleton, skeleton, barbarian, barbarian, go. Yeah. And the double skelly kill. There it is. Another staff. Well. I do still want to continue searching and looking around. But I'm, I am excited that we figured out whatever that thing, the, the mad god thing is. Super stoked. Alright. This just leads down here, then we can come back up here, we can go this way. Magic mouth. That was weird. I mean, I don't know what I expected when they said a magic mouth, but uh, it was not a a wall. Uh, oh, sorry, a mouth inside of a wall. That was not what I was envisioning. But, you know, that's, that's okay. Alright, this is a dead end. Again, remember, we're trying to fully map the place as mo well as best we can. I think we've done pretty okay. What's in here? It's a million spiders. Alright. Uh, what is it? War Strike? Yeah, let's hit him with a War Strike. And defend, and that should just kill him. All dead. We'll take it. That was super undangerous for us, because it was just spiders. And that was actually worth a very sizable chunk of experience. Alright, so, what I see right now... Um, if we go down here, there's something this way that we haven't gotten. And then if we come back up this way, and then over we can get this little area. Then up here, and then over here. And then this might even tie together somehow, down here and up over here. So, yeah. Well, that's kind of interesting. So we just go all the way down, and then we make a left. Okay, that... And... I don't really want that one. Alright, where does this puts us up top somewhere? It does. Alright, I guess we'll do this then since we're this is the like closest path that we can take. Alright, what's in here? Seven wolves and six half orcs. Could be a little nasty. Um we'll hide. I'm gonna cast our war strike again. This time on the wolves, I think. No, on the half orcs. Yeah. Alright. If we were attacking the half orcs, I could have cast it on the wolves. Man, we got Molly Walk crazy. Man. Um I'll hit the half orcs. Defend, defend. Three wolves we just can go all in on the wolves. Uh, one down, two down, Marcus hit for six, but he was probably one of the ones that we were... Alright, half orc, half orc, wolf, wolf, Let's see if we can get it. Nope, five points of damage on the wolf. 17 on a half orc, and 31 on a half orc. Then attack, 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 attack. 
There we go. 554 experience. Hey, Merlin and Omar leveled up. They might have leveled up a while ago. I really wasn't looking down at their uh, names and stuff. Cool. Alright. Look at the map. Um, I think we just backtracked the way we came. Where do I go from here? Left. Then up and around. Okay. Alright, left and then up and around. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright, this is fine. Oh, hold on. I apparently missed something down this way. Don't know how, but I did. Apparently my brain's just like, nah, you don't want to walk in that little tiny spot. Okay. Nah, I don't feel like dealing with spellcasters at a distance. That's just, that feels bad, you know? I still like to know where I, that portal, I swear I saw the portal. Oh, maybe it was on the other side of this wall. Yeah, okay. So like, I swear I saw a por portal here or something. Okay, so if we go here and down, I think we'll do that first, and then we'll go up. There we go, and boom. Okay, that seems fine. You dead nomad, and everybody kill the spiders. And the final spider is Dunzo. Very nice. Mithril chain, again, not really what we're after. Also, we're at max. Capacity. Okay. I think we drop this. We drop that. I guess it's a little bit of wiggle room for items. Alright, if we go left, up, and around, we go there, and we go up, right, up, and around. Okay. Right? Yeah, right here. Okay. All right, and nothing. Tar Tarjan, Tar Tar. Yeah, we're just gonna pretend it's a T, even though it might be a G or a C. Okay, I see how we get to that place as well. Ooh. Uh. I don't really want to fight Black Widows. They're they poison us. I don't want to fight things that are going to poison us. I mean, it's fine, but we only really have one spell that lets us remove poison. This is fine. Hide in the shadow. Defend, defend. I think we're on our way out now after we finish, like, the last little room over here. Uh, attack, 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 attack. All right. And a bunch of kills. Uh, B, B, B. Back, defend, defend. Alright. B, 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 B. Okay. <sighs> there we are. 508. I'll take it. And we go forward and then down. I love that we have this journal. It makes exploring and not having to map things out manually so very nice. Uh, you know what? We just we've skipped them so many times. Let's uh, let's give it a shot. Um, I'm going to defend, but I'm going to actually cast with you, my friend. Hook him up. Okay. Or golden. 
kill, 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 and one that survived. And Marcus and Sir Grady. All right, there it is. And then we got the invisibility. So if we do the second bard song, and we get uh, Kyleiran's invisibility spell on us, we're up to or down to minus six at the highest or the lowest armor. And then minus 16 at the highest, which is, I got a guess, pretty good. And the minus six is actually on our guest. All right, so at this stage, we've searched everything. And then we know there is a portal here going down and a portal here going down. We don't know what that means or where that leads. But we got the magic mouth. I don't know if a portal is like worse than a staircase. It sounds dangerous. So I'm going to avoid that for now. Because it's like a different way of traversing. And what we're going to do is we're going to leave. If I can figure out how to get there. Uh, okay, I kind of think I know. I think we go here, we go this way, right, and then we go down, yeah, okay. Then we go here, wait, no, we go up. Right, yeah, and then we go through the stairs, and then we get blinded by the magic. And then we go to you. You use magic flame. I don't think we need anything else right now. And I guess we'll fight our way out. Give us something to do, probably. Um, let's attack the wolves. And then we're gonna hide in the shadows. I'm gonna cast War Strike on the orcs and then we'll defend marcus got hit by the wolf brian and sid killed a wolf marcus flipped the wolf and murdered almost all of the orcs but one wolf dead wolf dead orc might be dead and one of the skeletons is dead all right Dead Skelly, dead wolf, dead orc, dead other wolf, single skeleton. All right. Beautiful. We're coming up close to 100,000 as well on the cash money side of things. Uh, zombie, conjurer, conjurer, conjurer. I think Brian can kill the zombie by himself. Okay. Eh. Oh, he did not kill the zombie by himself. There we go. Uh, let's go with five. Well, you know what? Let's see if we can run through this. There we can. All right. That doesn't matter. Um, then we go up and right. Yeah, there we go. I'm remembering my maps. Nah. I wonder what I wonder what we do in the temple once we talk about the mad god. Tarjan? Tar, Tarkan? Tarjan? That's Jan. It's definitely Jan. Oh, it's nighttime too. Oh. I, I think nighttime only really affects the town itself. I don't think the like the enemies down in the levels below are stronger at night. I could be wrong, though. I really don't know. Uh, heal the entire party. That costs 600. That's great. That was next to nothing. And we're going to go and rest. Okay. We're going to go and we're going to sell. I don't think there's anything to identify. All right, 
Still sell. 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 Arrows. 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 Spear. 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 Why is there a one? Like in brackets. Oh. Oh. It's because they are. Okay. I understand. Uh, I could maybe have stacked them up. I got to try that next time. Because they are also ranged weapons, so technically you could throw those weapons. If you do, you use them when you throw them. So Something to be aware of. A lot of plate armor. All right, we're down to 21 items. Hmm. Okay, oh wait, um, I do want to see. Do, does it, do we ever get new things to buy? Doesn't seem, well, the mithril chain. Actually is new. To buy because we have it. Uh, okay, hold on. I'm curious. I, I want to try. I'm going to do a test here. And I may immediately regret it. Do we do we sell the mithril knife? Do we have... Hold on. Let's, I, I don't care about the mithril knife that we have. I'm going to sell it. Our dagger. Okay, now if we go to buy. Does that become an option? And can we buy more than one of those? Because if that's the case, I'm going to do a quick save here. I'm testing something. So if I quick load this, but that's uh, that, that's why here. All right. So does Mithril Dagger stay as, a, as an option? And can we buy more than one? No. I can only buy the one. But what if we leave and then we come back? Nope. It's just the one one time thing. And it was like two hundred? And then how much should we sell it for? A hundred. That's fine. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna reload it. Because I was thinking if like we brought a, a weapon or something to him and we sold it to him and then he's like, Oh, cool. And then he knows how to craft it. We sell him the mythical sword, and then we can buy like four of them or five of them or whatever right and then we actually have a good weapon for everyone but alas doesn't look like it works that way oh well my dreams are just have to wait all right we're level 10 now advancement for merlin one hit point six spell points i'm okay with that and for omar three hit points six spell points that's good and we got a little bit of dexterity, so maybe he's a little bit quicker now. Let's actually take a look at everybody's decks. Uh, 15, 16, 17, 18, 9, and 15. So technically... Technically, Omar could very possibly be one of the faster people on our team. Because he's got... I Okay, I mean, he's faster than, than old Merlin, but... I mean, he's he got the second lowest, I guess, tied with uh, our male human paladin. Still, not too bad. All right, what's the next level for our spellcasters? Oh, that is much higher. 60,000, and we're only at 55. Well, okay, it's just a 5,000 higher thing. That's fine. And then... I. Here you can see how it breaks down since we're doing three attacks. It's and he has a one to sixteen. It's three to forty-eight damage. He's got a plus two to hit, and he's doing three attacks. And I think his weapon is six to ten. Oh, he's doing three attacks. So it's four to ten. Yeah, so he's doing twelve to thirty. And then he's only got a single attack with a two to eight. You got a single attack with a three to four, so on and so forth. All right, it, it's cool. I, li I like the breakdown there. I, I hadn't looked at that quite as closely in a long time, so too bad. Um, We're going to need to, of course, uh, redo all of our spells and everything. So we're going to come back over here to the spell thingy where we can get our points back, and we're going to break off the episode. Hope you guys enjoyed, and then I should absolutely... You know what? Before we do this... <laughs> I'm going to go see what this is about. 
It's the East guys? These guys? This is the Temple of the Mad God. What is the business, unbeliever? Speak to the priest. Only those who know the name of the Mad One are welcome. What would you say? So was it Car? No. Was it Gar? Uh, maybe. Car no, it is T. It's Tar... Jan? Jan. Jan, right? Tarjan? Tarjan. Tarjan. That's it, right? Speak not the name of the High One so loudly, lest he awaken. He says, enter the catacombs, believer. Oh, it's, it leads to another dungeon. I didn't know what this was going to do. Ah, uh, uh oh. Around you stretches miles of winding, twisting tunnels. The ancient bones of acolytes jut out of the earth. I'm going back up the stairs. I walked forward and I walked right back out. Okay, catacombs. I guess we'll take on the catacombs in the next episode, folks. Cool. Did, did not know what that was going to do. Very, very, very nice. Anyway, folks, until the very next episode, I've been your host, Bumpy McSquiggums. Thank you so much for stopping by the Freak Show. We play, we fight, we conquer. <laughs>